Hello everyone, this is Joe for Soft Corners here and for today's video I'm doing my um, contest video response for um, THA card story. Um, first off, I just want uh, anytime I watch their videos, Tyrus usually does the intro and he always says the card story. Um, so I just usually repeat that, but I, and I just noticed in their last couple videos, every time Matt has to correct them to say, uh, THA or the Hank Aaron card story. So, um, moving forward, I'll try and refer to it as that, uh, but, um, Every time I've mentioned these guys, I mean, same thing. If you haven't seen their videos, definitely check them out. Um, approaching 100 subscribers, uh, I think they have around 90. I didn't check today, actually, but um, father and son basically just collecting all the Hank Aaron cards and then lots of other side project um, distractions along the way, too. But um, just really great uh, father-son duo and really great channel there so um for their <clears throat> this is their third contest i believe which um so they're doing um a contest every um for hank aaron's um the totals he finished every year with so his first year i believe was 14 home runs and then followed up with 26 so they did a contest at 14 and then 40 and then this is their third one. Uh, I think he hit 26 again his third year. So this was for their um, for his 66th home run. And then I believe he followed that up with 44. So the next one will be at 110 um, subscribers, corresponding with his Hank Aaron's home runs after his fourth year. But um, so for this one is really neat um they want us uh want us to show off just any kind of combo card so it could be um any of the cards from any of the well any set um where it's multiple guys on one card um through most of the, the sets in the 50s and 60s for tops they like had some little like name to the card with two to sometimes four or five guys on the card um or any league leaders cards, uh, rookie cards that have more than one player. Um, so I was pretty certain what my card was gonna be before I even looked back through any, and it definitely is gonna be that card, but then I have five other cards to show off, so we'll get into it right away. This first one, I didn't really, um, I didn't really think of this, um, before I started looking back through my binders, but um, when I saw it, I just thought this one was really cool for, um, <clears throat> most of the other ones will include at least one player, which is pretty fitting for this video, but um, I just thought this one was pretty cool. You don't see, you know, a lot of people show off and just three, I feel very underappreciated Hall of Famers and definitely Killebrew and Robinson and then Yastrzemski is a 68 tops. Um, the, the 67 RBI leaders, so. That one. Um, this is one uh, I like a lot of the combo cards from this set. Um, from This is from 59 Tops. Um, I know that the, the Cleveland Indians one is really nice. Um, I think it's the Destruction Crew. I know it has Rocky Colavito, I believe Larry Doby, and it might be Minnie Minoso. I'm not sure, but I know that one's really nice. I don't. I thought I had that one, but I don't believe I do. But this is um, uh, Hitters Foes, and this well, obviously um, doesn't feature Sandy Koufax, but three other. Uh, Dodgers greats there and Hall of Famer Don Drysdale, uh, Johnny Padres, and Clem Levine. So all these ones just, <clears throat> I think they, a lot of them have that background that kind of looks like that, kind of looks like either sunset or sunrise in the background. So 
like that one. Uh, and I guess a little bit of a giveaway, and like I said, it'll be very fitting. <laughs> the rest of the four cards all have at least um, one player the same in all of them. Uh, I said very fitting for this, but it wasn't really done on purpose. It's just has a lot of great combo cards. So this is the Power Plus card with Hank Aaron and Ernie Banks from 63 Tops. <laughs> I also like the, um, I believe it's NL, NL Hit Kings from 63. It's Willie Mays and Stan Musial. Um, so obviously my favorite player of all time and Willie Mays on the card. Um, but just the look of it, I, I like that one better just for the look of the card. Um, so here's a great, another great league leaders card. This is from 1961, this is the 1960 um, NL, yeah, NL home run leaders. So you have, yeah, there's pretty sure it was, uh, Ken Boyer, and then three Hall of Famers, and Ernie Banks, Eddie Matthews, and Hank Aaron. So if anybody probably couldn't tell so far uh, what, probably anybody that's seen my videos or just has an idea already of, you know, mentioning one of the players on the last two are from 58 tops. Um, I just love the, the combo cards in this set. The first is the Braves fence busters with Del Crandall, Joe Adcock, Eddie Matthews, and Hank Aaron. I can't remember the name of it for sure, but I know that Al, it's definitely Al Kaline and I think it's Harvey Keen. It's the combo card for, it's Tigers something is the name of the card. Um, but I know that's another great looking one from this set. And if you haven't guessed it, I've showed this off many times, but it's definitely my favorite combo card. The World Series batting foes from 58 tops of Hank Aaron and Mickey Mantle. Just the two of these guys together on a card and the look of the card itself is, I just love this card. I had to take a double take. I forgot, I forgot the screen's mirrored. So, um, show the back the back you can't read all of it because it was in a binder at one point but <clears throat> um i did take a double take because obviously his hank aaron's 57 tops is the uncorrected error the reverse negative of him batting left-handed so when i had it in the camera here i thought did they screw up on this one too and did i not know about it till now but then when i looked at it pulled it down and looked at it I just forgot about the camera being reversed but so those are that is my favorite combo card um there's definitely some great ones that I could I thought of but I I don't own yet um that I'd love to own um so for this contest really looking forward to um seeing the responses because there's some great ones out there um I know in their video they uh, forgot to announce the prizes, so the prizes will be announced in their uh, Scattershot Saturday video this Saturday, I believe. And um, I think from it was three weeks from this Sunday, so I'm not sure of the exact date. I think maybe December 18th. Um, you have to get your responses in, but um, I know it's three weeks from this past Sunday, so um, definitely if you haven't check these guys out, make a um, response and support them. And yeah, uh, Matt and Tyrus, thank you for doing this video. It's, I always love 
any videos like any video responses I can do just you know another reason to make content which um, is always great to have um, so just appreciate you guys and your channel and the generosity of your contests and thank you so everybody else thank you for watching take care and just remember any card can be a great looking card even if it has four soft corners thank you